Hello out there YouTube. What's going on guys? It is D Dunn here, the most chill COD player. Um, I am back from Chicago and I know that my last video, I told you guys my first video back would probably be <coughs> on Tuesday. And that cough is exactly why I can't. Um, I had a blast in Chicago. The wedding went great. Um, being able to officiate my brother's wedding and marry him and my sister-in-law was just a phenomenal experience. It went really well actually. Um, I hit all my lines and I remembered my speech and you know we had so much fun afterwards but being in Chicago being in crowded spaces with a lot of people and a lot of family members a lot of drinking um, I completely lost my voice and when I got it back I've had this <coughs> excuse me again I've had this <coughs> really awful cough today's the best that it's ever been so I thought I would try and knock out a commentary for you guys today so here we go um, I want to talk about Chewbacca mom uh, <laughs> um, it's it's a viral video I'm sure a lot of you guys have seen it if you are on social media at all but basically in case you haven't seen it uh, there's like this regular you know hefty middle-aged soccer mom she was really excited because she got a, a Chewbacca mask from Kohl's he put it on and when you talk, the mouse moves, and then it makes sounds like a Wookiee or a Chewbacca would make. And it's pretty funny. The thing is, uh, you know, she starts talking, and then she just starts laughing hysterically, and she's laughing, and the mouth is moving, and it's a mix of, like, her laugh and Chewbacca. And, you know, it made me chuckle. It made me chuckle. I thought it was kind of funny. Um, but the video went absolutely viral. Um, it, I don't know, it has, you know, tens of hundreds of millions of views or something retarded and um it was weird because you know i heard that Coles gave her a bunch of like gift cards um she got to go meet like chewbacca in disney world or disneyland or wherever um which is really cool you know stuff like that obviously it's you know she said that she, you know in her video i went to Coles and i bought this mask so it gave them a lot of exposure so they gave her like gift cards and stuff i get that but I'm reading through some articles today, and I see that there's a university in Florida that has given this woman and all of her kids full tuition to their college. And their explanation is that her video, you know, she was obviously very joyful and it gave people a lot of joy to watch her video, made them laugh, whatever. Um, and so they wanted to also spread joy to her family. Um, in reality, what it is, is it's this university coattailing off her popularity to get their name out there to more people uh, by doing what they, you know, is perceived as a very generous act, um, you know, to, you know, make them seem philanthrop philanthropic. So other, you know, people will say, oh, yeah, let's let's look at that university. They seem really nice. They gave Chewbacca mom and her family scholarships. <coughs> but whenever I read it. <coughs> I thought it was absolutely ridiculous. Um, in the article, it goes on to say that they interviewed a student who goes there, and he's like, you know, I have a family. I have two jobs. He's like, I work two jobs and have student loan debt in order to pay for my college tuition here. And this mom just has a video on the Internet that's really popular, and so she and all of her kids get a full ride. That's that's not fair. And I'm not trying to sound like a whiny millennial because I am – pretty much the farthest away from that but it doesn't make sense to me that people who work hard and are dedicated to something in the first place aren't being rewarded whenever you have other people who are given massive gifts just for viral videos i understand you know to some degree people who become popular um you know with really creative things um you know art ideas or you know even you know people who do like video game video you know videos and stuff those are entertaining um you know to some degree there's a level of talent that goes into video games uh, especially you know if you're like a pro gamer there's obviously a lot of time involved a lot of dedication um you know <coughs> cooking channels makeup channels uh music channels all of those things you know they take time they have some level of skill involved some more than others you have to have personality this lady literally just made a video of her putting on a mask and she thought it was hilarious so she laughed and everyone laughed because it looks really stupid and 
she is getting massively rewarded for it for little to no effort, no work. And I don't understand why people latch onto this stuff. I understand why people watch it. Like, it's funny to watch this, like, middle-aged fat mom get so much joy out of a child's toy. I get that. That is funny. I chuckled. But I don't understand why people are rewarded for this kind of stuff. Why does she, you know, get, you know, full ride tickets and trips? Why does she get tens of thousands of dollars worth of merchandise? Why does she get, um, you know, tens of thousands of dollars of worth of scholarships to college that has nothing to do with anything about what she did? She did nothing to help anyone else. She just happened to catch a popular ride. <coughs> And she's being massively rewarded for no effort whatsoever. And it's stuff like this that really bugs me about, you know, some like society stuff. Obviously, you know, notable examples like Kim Kardashian stuff, people who are very popular for doing absolutely nothing. And then for whatever reason, they just remain popular for just, I mean, for, I mean, no reason. I mean, Kim Kardashian sucked a popular dude's dick and put it on the internet. And now she makes a living off of that um, by riding the riding the fame, and uh, you know riding other things, and now she's just like a worldwide sensation. Now she's followed. Now she's a millionaire. I mean, obviously, she had ties with a popular family. And I don't want to turn this into a Kim Kardashian rant or a Chewbacca mom rant. What I'm really trying to say is, I just don't understand why hard work is not rewarded. Why could they not give, you know, three to five scholarships, however many it was, I'm not sure. Why could they not give that to other people? Now, I'm not trying to take away from, you know, the <coughs> from this university because it also did say that they provide scholarships, um, you know, up to like $25 million they give in scholarships. And that's fine. But I feel like there's a way better way to give back to the community and to other people than, you know, by giving it to people who don't deserve it and just using it as like a publicity stunt. I think that's unfair to people who actually need it. Um, this place is in Florida. I am sure that there are impoverished communities around that area in Florida where they could probably send, you know, uh, I don't know, you know, it, maybe not a full ride, but they could easily give five to $10,000 scholarships to probably an entire senior class for what they're trying to give you know, a family of five full ride scholarships for, or I don't really honestly know how many people are in the family, but you get what I'm saying. There are better ways to hand out money and hand out rewards to people. And I think it needs to be, you know, taken a little bit more seriously. You know, a lot of people probably thought this was a really great move for the university. They probably thought it was a really great thing. And, you know, it is nice and the family should take it. But to me, whenever... <coughs> Whenever I read this article, I was actually really pissed off. And that's kind of what I want to talk about today. I would love to get your guys' opinion down below in the comment section. Um, you know, even if you disagree with me, that's fine. Like, if you just think I'm being a huge dick bag and I'm just jealous of, you know, Chewbacca Mom's success, then you can put that down there. You know, I'm willing to, you know, argue my points. That's fine. But uh, I, d I just think it's a little ridiculous whenever people are rewarded for doing nothing and something that requires no talent so anyway that's my opinion guys i'm sorry i coughed a lot but again um i just wanted to get a video out especially since i promised one like four days ago but i hope you guys did enjoy this one if you did feel free to leave a like rating if you hated it that's fine dislike it leave me a comment why so i can improve my content in the future and if you are new to my channel and you really enjoyed my content please consider a subscription it would mean a lot and for all of you who stayed this long to the video and took your time to watch it i really appreciate your time it means a lot sincerely so anyway like i said guys i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one bye